What's going on guys, SpikeZillion here, and today we're actually going to be reacting to the Master Duel ban list. Uh, I heard this one is fucking crazy, <laughs> so that's why I wanted to do this video. Now, obviously, with this channel, I have done very little voiceover work so far. It's been mostly just replays of Master Duel, uh, in addition to a few videos that I've just edited together for Smash. So... If you're not used to the voice, I apologize, but if you're from the old channel, then welcome back. We're back. Uh, we're chillin'. But I wanted to do a reaction of this Forbidden Limited list for Master Duel, because apparently it's fucking crazy. I already saw the first card, so it's kind of not a surprise, but I'm still shocked. Guys, they did it. <laughs> they did it. <laughs> Hulk is banned. Um, This surprisingly does not affect me. In the decks that I currently play. So I still play. So right now I'm playing like. Obviously Harpies. Uh, I play Shadals. I play Sulfa Quartz. The Sulfa Quartz can use Halk. They don't need him though. Because. Thank god. Heavy Metal Foes Electromite is still in the game. As it should be. Um, so. I'm not worried about it. And thankfully it looks like this is the only card that's getting banned. Uh, out of all the links. Thank god. So. That's pretty good, but Hulk being banned is crazy, right? Like, finally, between OCG and TCG, has been untouched, has been the reason many other cards have been banned. But they did it. And this probably means that Auroradon will no longer be touched. I don't know how I feel about that, because I feel like Auroradon can still be abused. So, I don't know. We'll see how this goes. But uh, this is a good step, right? It's a good step. Let's see, let's go a little bit further here. Cards will be limited. Thank fuck. Oh my god. Fuck the adventure engine. Fuck everything about the adventure engine. I hope it dies. I hope they just ban the griffin, honestly. Or they make adventure, like, fateful adventure go to one or something. Actually, no. We want right to one. We want right to one and enchantress to one. Hopefully we see the right as well as we scroll down here. Spellbook of Judgment being unbanned? What? And they're making a spellbook structure deck? Ooh, I might have to try that. That sounds like fun. Uh, this deck, this card's broken though. Really? During the end phase of this turn, uh, of the turn this card was activated, add spellbook spell cards from your deck to your hand, except spellbook of judgment, up to the number of spell cards activated after this card's resolution. Then, you can special summon from your deck one spellcaster monster whose level is less than or equal to the number of cards added to your hand by this effect. Um, I don't know what to say. This card is fucked. Like, I don't really... I mean, obviously you can ash it, right? For the then part. But like, come on, man. This card's fucked. <laughs> this card's fucking broken. Um, especially because it's a quick play as well, right? Uh, it's at one. That's crazy. I'm I'm shocked. I don't know what to say. That's crazy. I'm surprised. Out of all the cards that were on the ban list, this is not the one I would expect to get unbanned. But here we are. Is there more? Oh, we're going to semis now. Rivalry? Really? Are people getting mad about rivalry? I mean, what's what's playing rivalry, right? Um, true Draco? No. I think they're playing... Well, they're not playing Gozen, I suppose. Yeah, I guess they could play Rivalry. I don't know. Who's playing Rivalry? This is a weird hit. This is not a, um... God, I hate that the ads are playing in the fucking corner. It's probably gonna get me demonetized. I should probably have added an ad blocker before I started this, but... I, uh... I, I try to not use ad blocker. I try to support people, but... God, this is annoying. Anyways, um... Rivalry, huh? I don't, I don't know. Weird. Gozen? Oh, that's just, that's no bueno. How are my harpies supposed to flood gay people now? Use barrier statue? Oh, God. <laughs> you know what's fucked up? They didn't even, they didn't even touch barrier statue, so. I feel like that would shut down flunders, and I think that would make things way better. Like, I, I don't want barrier statue banned. Um, as well as not wanting some org banned. However, 
I will say that banning barrier statue would solve a lot of problems with a lot of the people, a lot of people's problems that they have with those decks. For instance, blunders with barrier statue being normal at the end of the combo, or uh, you know, Lyraless Tri Brigade going with some Morg Pass, right? I I think. It's easier to hit those decks, but they probably won't do that because all these ban lists have been friggin' tiny. So I think it's easier to just ban Barrier Statue overall. Which sucks because it it hurts my deck, but it's fine. Rogue decks kind of have to die for that. Raigeki to two. Now this I can get behind. Actually, I think Raigeki could go to three, honestly. Um, I think Lightning Storm should go to one. In my opinion, I think Lightning Storm is a, a better card overall. It's surprising that Raigeki does not, you know, like it gets hurt more treatment wise. I think the reason why is because Lightning Storm is specific in that it's attack position monsters. But I think overall, Lightning Storm is a more difficult thing to work around because it is effectively a 50 50 card that is effective in more situations than something like Feather Duster as a draw, for example. So I don't, I don't know, man. Um, I, I'm mixed. I, I feel like Lightning Storm should be at one, and Regeki should be at three, personally. But maybe. Uh, Trish going to two. Now this doesn't really make any sense. That being said, I don't think anyone can do anything with this. I'm, maybe I'll try to like jank people with this now. That's pretty funny. I saw somebody playing like a six Sam recursion, where they played like Trish and they would like recur the Trish. Um, and I thought that was quite funny. So, like, that's a thing. You can make that. Um, and man, I guess you could do it easier now because there's two of them. But, yeah. Thing. Zen Mighty to two. This does anything. I don't, I don't even know. Wait, Zen Mighty was not banned? Wait, what? Did I abuse this? What level is this? It's two level threes. Mm. Can I abuse this? What does this do? Detach. So summon a wind up. Uh, when a monster on the field is destroyed, since the graveyard detaching Z's from this card to target that monster, return that target to the hand. Yeah, isn't this card broken? Don't you play this with like wind up hunter and just fucking recur forever? Like what? I don't know. This is interesting. Um, Dragon Buster to two. I don't think that does anything. Um, th uh, this card's broken though. Is there a way you can make two of them in one turn? Is that possible? Maybe. Light stage to two. This deck is really annoying, um, but it's not the most broken either, though. You can play around this deck pretty easily. But light stage is part of the part of the difficulty. Um, I don't know. This this is fine. I think this is fine. Um, going to two is fine. Case. Red Reboot, now this I can get behind. Oh my god, bring it to three, fuck it. Fuck all Floodgate cards, like, fuck all Floodgate decks, dude, honestly. Like, fuck Eldritch decks, honestly. Put this shit to three. It, this shit, like, genuinely could not get any more, any better. Like, Red Reboot is... Like, the card that I, I genuinely think needs to be unbanned completely. It is the card. Like, this meta, um, because it's a best-of-one format, it's just genuinely better to play a Floodgate deck that's just a bitch-made, I'm um, sitting in the corner being a bitch deck um, over, like, the combo decks, for the most part. Um, and the fuck does that card... Decks like Eldritch can just play Adventure on top of that. So, like, they can get a negate going if you, like, Feather Duster, right? But let alone Solemn Judgment, right? There's gonna be Solemns in there as well. Because uh, they don't care about life points. Who cares? Um, so, yeah. Fuck. Fuck Floodgate decks. This is huge. So, I think... I think in, in for, for Master Duel specifically, this can go to three. I think it would be a, a better decision to just bring this just fucking flat it out so we can actually play like real decks and not just like bitch ass decks the one hanky to two that's probably fine i don't think anyone's really playing this shit anymore 
Um, like, like they're only playing this to have like another version of Cyber Dragon that like has a tribute quick effect and like, I don't know, like maybe I can play it. I don't know. I don't. I don't really see a reason to. It's not like, I don't know. In this format, I feel like it's just not that good. But uh, I don't know. With being level seven is nice, but being dinosaur does not benefit like most decks. Dinosaur is just like a fucking. It's very like specific. You, you kind of have to have like dinosaur cards, like dinosaur support, to get anything out of dinosaur. Like nothing, off the top of my head, there's like nothing Xyz wise, nothing Link wise that wants to be dinosaur that like benefits other decks outside of the dinosaurs. So it's kind of kind of bad. Like I don't know, maybe that was the point, that was the balance of it. But like yeah, this format it feels like Hanky's just there to be twenty six hundred and attack and then tribute basically make your opponent go minus one right that, that's the whole point i guess i don't know he's probably fine um i don't want spirals back this is like this is probably fine though um as long as it's not master plan although i think master plan's in the that one i could be wrong um i don't really like spirals I think they're really cancer. I think they're really annoying. Not really into them. Yeah, ideally get spirals out of here. This this is hot. Right here. This is epic. Uh I'm I can I can get down with this. Um maybe I should start playing more Pendulum Magicians. This is really cool. Um I'm down with double iris, two double iris. Uh, targeted Dark Spellcaster. I think this also followed the OCG. I think the OCG also did this. Uh, let's see. Apply this effect. Destroy this card. Once applied, double any battle damage that monster inflicts to your opponent. Um, I think it's more for the monster effect, right? Because, uh, if this card is destroyed by battle or card effect, you can add one Pendulum Graph card from your deck to your hand. So you add the Star Pendulum Graph or whatever. The, the Continuous Spell, I think. And then that goes fucking crazy. Obviously, I can't really use that for sulfur cords as much. Because um, sulfur cords kind of do their own thing. They're kind of special. But uh, being a scale 8 is pretty neat. Um, it gives me another monster I could search instead of harmonizing for the Pendulum Call. So it might be might be something I could look forward to. But I think Pendulum Magicians in general is just kind of in its own world. Uh, this I don't like. Our porter is kind of annoying. Fuck. I don't need to with this thing. Um, although it is hard once. Uh, I don't know. I don't think they need a second one, man. Like, the fact that... like they, I'm pretty sure they can already recur their banished cards anyway. To some extent. Um, the field spell is really annoying. I don't know if the field spell is banned or not, though. I think it is. Um... No, oh, it's probably not, right? I've definitely seen Orcus uh, a handful of times. I've always disliked them. I think Harpoor 2 is not really something I want to see, but that's kind of whatever. Um, I don't know. We'll see how this goes. Cards be unlimited. Um, sure. I don't really have anything to say about that. Now, this is hot. Um, why was it at 2 anyway? I don't really understand. Um, but this this is cool. I can I can get down with this. Um, I love harmonizing. Big fan. So this is this is good. Uh, so this is the full changes. Um, pretty good, right? This is a pretty good band. I think probably my highlight for me is Red Reboot. Red Reboot. Good. Go two three. This format. Anyone agree? Let me know in the comments. Because I think Red Reboot can go 2-3 this format. It is a best-of-one piece-of-shit format. While we're there... Um, I don't know. Like... I don't know. I want to say fuck Sky Strikers too, but I don't really know how it... Fuck Sky Strikers. Like, I don't know. Just ban Engage. Fuck it. Just ban it. Shitty, stupid card anyway. Get rid of Engage, and we're good. We'll be, we'll be happy. Everybody will be jumping for joy. I think that would be really neat. Uh, also, ban Griffin, because OCG did it, and it's a good idea, and fuck Griffin. 
Um, and yeah. Because the problem is right now, right? Um, Enchantress going to one, that's only like half the battle, not even. It's like a third of the fight, right? Because then on top of that, they still have what? I think it's three right still, or two right. Um, so it's not like it's going to be difficult to make the combo still. It's just slightly harder. It's like what? They went from... So it's one, usually one Fateful, one Griffin, I guess now one Chantress, and, one, and two Rites. What is that? That's five cards out of 40? And it's not difficult to pull that. Like, even six out of 40 is not difficult to pull. You're probably going to pull that one in every two games, at least, ideally, I think, right? I could be wrong. Like, in, in opening hand, I mean. I, I don't know what the chances are of that. I don't know what the odds are. Um, someone can put that in the comments. I, th I think, like, even 5 out of 40 is still, like, good. You only need one card. It's a one-card combo, if we're being honest, right? You just need the right. That's all you need. So, I suppose, what I would say is just ban Griffin. This engine fucking sucks. Everything about this engine's fucking stupid. Get it out of here. Um, I don't... Again, I don't really understand that. I feel like the biggest L for me was like, um, I don't know where there's a bunch of stuff that's just not here that really just makes me scratch my head. Like, no Griffin ban, really, really annoying, right? Um, no Verte ban. That's that's super annoying. I'm still waiting for the Verte ban. Gone. He's not cool. Um. No Flunderies hits at all. Like, zero Flunder hits. Still no Flunder hits. Not a single one. I guess, technically, Red Reboot is kind of a Flunder hit, because you... I guess, but, like... Who fucking cares? It's, it, like... You're gonna give them a free Featherstorm set? Like, no. No one wants that to happen. Why would you do that? Like, I feel like... Flunders need... Like, put Robina to one, maybe? And, like... More than that, I mean, I would personally just, if I, if it was up to me, I would just fucking ban the whole deck, really, but, <laughs> that's just because I, I, like, the only cool Winged Beast deck is Harpies, the only cool one, uh, uh, no bias, just, you know, just objective fact, that's all it is, um, but, like, if I'm being honest, yeah, like, realistic bans for Flunders is, like, I think Robina to one is fair, right, um, and then, like, I don't know. Um, do, we, do we ban Ryza? I don't know. I feel like banning Ryza is a little bit necessary, but like at the same time, um, Apex Avion's a problem, right? Think back. Apex Avion is the secondary special summon of. Actually, yeah, banning Barrier Statue would also do it, right? But I'm thinking here's the thing, right? Uh, when Samorg finishes special summoning the barrier statue, the second thing he's gonna is Avion, right? And on top of that, if you're playing Fl on the other end of the spectrum, if you're playing Flunder and not with Samorg, right, obviously, because they don't really special summon, um, they will normal summon Apex Avion, pass, right? Now it's your turn. They negate, then they get Dreaming Town, make another Apex Avion, negate again. Chain once per chain. Um, so it's quite annoying. I feel like, ironically enough, stuff around the Flunders would shut the deck down. Like, M-Pen is my least favorite part of the deck that's in Archetype, but it makes sense because he's kind of the boss monster anyway. But the only reason that the deck pops off is because they are an engine to these like crazy control monsters which is barrier statue apex avion and ryza i feel like hitting them makes more sense but i feel like robina the only one that makes the deck go fucking crazy so it's like ban robina not really because the archetype on its own is like kind of... i feel like thinking about it in the longer term like i feel like banning barrier statue makes sense Maybe putting Ryza to one or banning Ryza. Probably banning Ryza 
would be like a decent solution because then what they have apex avion that's like the only thing they have left at that point they and then most people will probably just stop playing it which i think is fine because fuck flunders they're stupid um i don't know i don't know what else i would do that's the that's my first thought is that i mean i suppose they could play some of the other some ward cards like some of the like uh, effect monsters like jesus christ most of them are terrible um i don't know or they just play snowl which some of them do so anyway i think that's like some of the biggest l's is like just not enough hits still even after this ban list there's still not enough hits um i feel like more unbans in this list anyway and most of them are like pretty justified like they're pretty good choices like pinky's kind of whatever um, Double Iris is pretty cool going back up. Um, Zen Mighty is interesting. I don't know how that will work. Like, what what the difference that makes? Red Geki is a huge one. I think it could go to three. I think Red Reboot could go to three. Um, so this is like them just testing it out. I think Harmonizing going to three is at W. And I think Beginning of the End is a cool one. Um, it's only really used in one deck, right? It's usually like Dark World Dangerous, right? This is cool. Although with Tear, I don't know um, how much we're gonna go with that. Cause I, well, actually, I, I, I guess people wouldn't really play this, right? Cause they'd probably play Snow over this. Or Gizmek, I guess. Reggie, mostly Snow, though. Um, I think Snow's at one. I don't know. Um,. Hopefully in the TCG, Snow will get banned. Um, Master Duke will follow suit. I said. Anyway. Alright, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. Talk to you guys soon.